What is up guys? I am here at Matata Beach in the beautiful Bay of Plenty of Aotearoa, New Zealand and just look at the beautiful waves, the sands, the vibes. The sun has just set but it is beautiful here. Today I just wanted to have a little talk about some bits and pieces mainly to do with letting go now i know a lot of people when they hear that word of letting go they don't really want to know more about it they want to hold on they have things inside of them that keeps them in the cycle i call it karmic cycles and we all have those karmic cycles even myself and one thing we do do is we let go by drinking, we let go by taking drugs, we let go by fighting, drama, uh, getting aggressive, um, eating, and everyone goes through it. But what are you actually letting go of? And what I mean by that is, what things are you going through right now? that's keeping you in those cycles what can you identify within yourself to keep you in those cycles and that you haven't understood what they are right now and so you're always in this karmic cycle and the reason why is because you haven't understood the lessons that you're going through once you understand the lessons you're going through it becomes a lot more easier to let go and once you've let go boom it's like emptying a cup and I was talking to my mum about it the other day and talking to her about how we need to keep our cups empty or not fully empty but not full because if our cups are too full we want to learn new things we can't learn new things it starts overflowing and it becomes a mess like spilling your coffee when you put too much milk in so I said to her we need to let go of some of that stuff in our cup by understanding the things that's in it once we understand the things that's in it we can let it go it's like putting it down in the water on a boat sending it out there because you've dealt with it you've understood it and you've grown from it and so it's something that people don't really think about or do so they keep in these cycles and the cycles can get quite nasty can get quite dramatic and it can lead to things like suicide it can lead to things like overeating addictions and a whole bunch of different things and it's not easy we're all going through things ourselves we're learning we're understanding but once you understand and this is what the key to it and what I want to tell you guys is once you understand how to deal with it once you understand what to do with it you can then let it go and it's just that simple it is just that simple and it could be things in your life that you're going through right now that um, you don't really understand them and that's fine and it could be things in your life that were caused through trauma in the past it could even be trauma in the past life that you're carried over but if you understand them and what they're there for and what they're teaching you you can then let them go boom cleared you've leveled up it's like leveling up and um, we all go through that we all go through it it's about growing so you're not alone if you're going through any of that you're not alone and one of the biggest things that keeps people in these these cycles i call it karmic cycles is fear and also not forgiving they are the biggest ones so we have relationships with family with friends but some of our relationships are gone to crap and we forget about those relationships but at the end of the day somehow there's a cord still stuck to those people and the best way to end that cycle of karma 
is to forgive. And I uh, listened to a pod talk from Dolores Cannon and she was saying that to end the karmic cycle you need to forgive. Forgiveness is the ending of the cycle of karma. And she is right. Because I've seen that happen with myself. There are things in my past I've done that were, I would say, learning experiences. But to others, it was trauma. And I've gone back, asked for forgiveness, and healed. Healed those relationships, healed within, understood, and moved on. And that emptied part of that cup out so I could learn new things, new experiences. So if you're going through things, guys, forgiveness is one of the top keys. And you need to find the courage to forgive. If you can find that courage to forgive, I'm telling you right now, you will see beautiful times ahead, especially in your relationships with friends, with family, with work colleagues. You see those relationships blossom again. Just remember that forgiveness is the ending of the karmic cycle. Anyway, I just wanted to share, share with you that, guys. And um, I want to bring you guys some more insights and give you a little bit more insight into my thoughts from the heart, my thoughts from my mind. And uh, hopefully they can inspire you as well and give you guys some uh, inspiration to help you guys out there as well with whatever you guys are going through out there. Anyway, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. See you guys on the next video. And remember, experience the journey, inspire others, live life, guys. Peace.